Hi everyone, I'm Linda Loveland with this week's NC Farm Bureau Report. All attention this week was focused on the U.S. House of Representatives. First, the House voted to impeach President Donald Trump. Then they passed the U.S.-Mexico-Canada trade agreement. The bipartisan vote is a big win for farmers and comes at a critical time. The agreement is expected to increase U.S. ag exports by $2 billion. The Senate will take up the vote in the new year. And thank you to those who acted on the Farm Bureau Action Alert, which let your lawmakers know you support that trade agreement. If you haven't acted, that alert is still active. Your message will go to your senator. Hemp farmers will be able to use pesticides next year. The Environmental Protection Agency approved 10 pesticides for use on hemp for the 2020 growing season. The EPA is also proposing new, stronger protections to reduce exposure to atrazine. And finally, a holiday message from our new Farm Bureau President, Sean Harding. I just want to wish everyone a very Merry Christmas. I hope you have a great time with your family this year. And let's all look forward to a great 2020. Thanks for watching. I'll see you in the new year for another NC Farm Bureau Report.